This is Anything But Footy. I'm Michael. The British Olympic Association have responded to a legal threat by their own athletes, UK athletes, including Samo Farah, Adam Jamili, Laura Muir and other big names. And this is all about the way they have interpreted the IOC Rule 40. Rule 40 prevents members of Team GB from promoting personal sponsors or commercial partners during games time. That is a very broad definition of the rule. Now, the BOA have relaxed their viewpoint on this one, and they said basically athletes can can make one kind of mention of personal sponsors or commercial partners as long as they don't use Team GB or Olympic branding in doing that. That is not far enough for some athletes. This week, the BOA, the British Olympic Association, have responded in their words fully and robustly. They say they only learnt of the legal challenge through the media. They've said they have met athlete representatives to continue the dialogue. And they're dismayed that despite encouraging conversations between those athlete representatives and the BOA, the legal tactics continue. Now, Team GB, the British Olympic Association are not funded by you and me. They don't get any handouts from government. They don't get lottery money. They are an organisation that has to raise their money commercially. And they've always said that collective sponsorship, commercial agreements, as a collective, as a whole, is better for Team GB. That would then for therefore protect lesser-known names and the smaller sports. Uh, but the route continues with some of those big names uh, going in to the battle, if you like. And download our weekly Anything But Footy podcast for all the latest Olympic and Paralympic news, interviews and conversations. We're on Apple and Google Podcasts. Just search Anything But Footy.